Hey guys, <laughs> I am going to be Mary Ellen after 60. I really am. I'm actually going to do a test on my eyes because so many of you asked me to do this. So what I did is I took the best possible before pictures that I could take and I'm going to report back on this at a later time. I also did a little video of me, but what I wanted to tell you that I was doing because so many of you suggested I do this as I decided to do one eye with the US version of the Olo Olay Pro Retinol in the other eye with the UK version. So I have been doing this since May 14th. I've started and I'm doing the side of my face that has the big veins with the UK version of the Pro Retinol and the other side I'm doing with the US version. Now I started to be fair I started the US version on both my eyes way back on my birthday on February 14th, 2018. So both eyes have had a couple of months from February, March, April to May, just about actually three months of using this alone. Now the ingredients are very different as you all know. So I have strong opinions on this. I did buy a backup. I do see a difference in my eyes a slight softening of some of the deeper sharper lines but nothing hugely dramatic but enough of a little bit difference that I'm feeling it's making a difference now the UK version has totally stronger I guess ingredients than the US version so this I'm gonna be really curious to see if I'm gonna see a bigger difference you know when I keep using this but that's sort of my trial and um, and I'm going to you know probably report back June 14th thereabouts after it's been a month of using this this experiment both my eyes I do have to tell you both my eyes have different wrinkles I mean I, am I weird do you guys have the exact same wrinkles on both your eyes I don't my my this eye the one with my veins that side I have a deep line and it's probably the way I sleep so I have a deep line that goes up and you probably can't see it I, yes I have a ring light but I'm not using any filters if I didn't have the ring light you wouldn't see me because of the light background but um, I'm hoping in my regular pictures you'll notice it more but I do have a deeper line or wrinkle that I don't have on this this side I have lots more fine lines this side I have deeper lines if that makes sense. So of course I'm going to use the stronger one on my deeper line. I think that makes a ton of sense. And the weaker one on all my fine lines. So I've already been three months. Uh, this has been, what, a week? Roughly? So, you know, way too soon for me to have any kind of discussion on how I feel about this versus this. But I am liking this. I just, I'm not going to mislead anyone. It is not a dramatic change, but I am seeing a change. So whether I had this or not, I was going to plan on continue to use that. So that's sort of my, my pro Olay retinol, sort of like what I'm going to be doing. And I don't want this video to be too long, but I did get my, um, my boxy charm and I, you know, I mean, <sighs> I definitely am going to cancel the boxy charm. I am not a fan on the stuff that I've been getting and I'm thinking it's really a huge 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 waste of money I don't like the shadows I don't like the colors they pick so granted maybe I need to get with it a little bit more with different colors but you know I baby steps I am using a I don't know if you can tell I am using a um, a lighter liner not all the time but right now in this video i do have a lighter liner and that's that's sort of like it's the urban decay 24 7 glider um glide on eyeliner i bought three of them in that little pack and this is sort of like that lighter purpley one brownish purpley or whatever i like it i don't think it looks bad it just i, I like the black better but you know the things that i'm getting in my boxy chum pretty vulgar I tried to put this on you know and and I thought maybe it just looked worse in here than it does here <laughs> I was like there is no way no way I would be putting that on my lips unless I was getting ready to um, 
I should go out to Halloween party or something of that nature. So, yeah. So, anyways, this is a bust. And my boxy charm truly has been a bust. So I'm really disappointed with that. It's like, ugh. You know, I'm looking at the stuff and I'm, I'm just not happy with a lot of it. What you doing? Hi. <laughs> just wanted to say hi. You're gonna be in my um. You're gonna be in my tag video coming up. Okay. Okay. Can't wait. So that was that was Jay. For those of you that don't know, that's my husband. He likes to photo bomb me. But um, oh man, I forgot what I was gonna say. Oh. So the other thing I did want to say is that I am using the It Cosmetic CC Cream. This is the illumination, the 50 SPF. I'm gone. I've gone back to trying to wear this. I had really stopped wearing it all winter, but I'm thinking now that summer or spring, I should say, has finally hit, that maybe my skin will be okay with this. My skin is really dry. I know you really can't tell, but my skin is like really super dry. So I usually put a face oil on, and then when I use my Boots Number no. Seven Lift and Luminate, that just glides on my skin. It's like really, really awesome. But it, it only has like a 15 SPF. It doesn't have a 50. So um, I'm trying, so I put a little bit more oil on my face and then I put this on and it it went on good. It's, it's you know, it's good. It's good, good, good. And it's 50 SPF. So I also want to use it. I have a lot of this left and I also have another tube of it left. I have a little bit of a darker color that I was going to mix. So that is what I'm going to be doing for the summer and the spring on my skin and it's going to be really important that I kind of get some really good coverage because we have a couple of trips coming up and I don't want to I don't want to mess with my skin you know so anyways I know this is probably a little longer than I wanted I just wanted to make it a quick update on this for you guys so that you would know what the plan is and uh, I will definitely report back so this eye and this eye cutting my face right down the middle. Thanks so much, guys. Hey, and if you're new to my channel, please subscribe. Truly appreciate it. Bye-bye.